Cars travel pretty fast on Bear Valley Road in Hesperia. The speed limit here is 40 miles per hour, right in front of this car wash where Monday afternoon, gusty high desert winds rolled a stroller with a baby inside of it right out toward the road. That's the little one's great aunt struggling to get back on her feet after falling as the nightmare plays out. She sees nobody. She sees the child going into the street and that's all she sees. She can't do nothing. Ron Nesman was waiting on a bench outside the car wash when he saw the woman in her 60s go down hard on the asphalt while trying to catch the stroller. Didn't have time to even think about it. I just You just react. Here he is on camera running over with the intercept, saving the baby boy before he made it all the way down the driveway and into the passing cars. And I said, you know, I, I got it, you know what I mean? Because I seen, I felt so bad for the lady. It was like, uh, I couldn't imagine. I got nephews and nieces. I couldn't imagine something like that. But Ron says he can imagine being in that kind of distress because he's felt it before. My girlfriend passed away in 2018. And uh, so sorry. It, yeah, it was sudden. So I didn't want to do anything. The former truck driver says he became homeless after that heartbreak and only recently moved to Hesperia to reconnect with his family. He had just wrapped up a job interview when he unknowingly stepped into a new role as this little boy's hero. I wouldn't be able to live with myself if I did nothing, of course, you know. I'm just glad I realized it and was on it, you know. Watch breaking news on YouTube. Subscribe to ABC7 Chicago Eyewitness News.